Oh! Oh! The Salvadorian Retriever. Welcome to beautiful Puerto Rico. Here we're gonna be doing some iguana hunting with a couple friends. I hope you enjoy. All right, y'all, so we were actually in a mall in Puerto Rico. They got the First Bank, the Baby Depot by Burlington, and they have Marshall Mega Store. Oh, look at that. Whoa. What's the best for killing iguanas? What's the best for killing iguanas? How many should we take? It's 500. It's 500. 500 no. That's enough fun. Go this. Thanks. Do you shoot like make noise? Yeah, noise, only noise. Oh, okay. Did you see that leg tree out there? What ligma tree? So they have these pest control boxes right here and I don't know if they're using this to try to catch the iguanas with I know back home in the states we use this to catch rodents dude it's coming down He's coming down. He's right there. I don't know how he's still holding on. Look at him. Dude. Bro, these iguanas from Puerto Rico are something else, dude. <laughs> oh! Oh! Look. Oh! 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 <laughs> hey, Pincho Iguana tonight. You want some? No, no. The Salvadorian Retriever. See that other one there? No. You just put a bunch I of BBs in here, man. Dip, dude. That's some hard dip, bro. Eh? Hagen, long cut, winter green. Oh. You can see they got mouths full of ammo. So right now we're going through this really, really thick grass right now. Oh shoot! Is that cotton? Iguana man. Right now we are in Puerto Rico doing some iguana hunting. And these iguanas are so feisty and so smart, they do not let you get close to them. So we had to come out here today, and what are we using today? Just using some pellet rifles. Buddy. I'm shocked, but I sold my pellets. I do a time lapse real quick. All these iguanas. The iguana looks like the Joker, bro. It's a lot of room inside here, so we're gonna see what else we can catch and fill inside of our bus. Ooh. Oh! He just Christmas yes! tree! Dude, he just Christmas tree, bro. This has iguana right there. Oh my gosh. Ooh, 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 they got another crow on Christmas. Oh! <laughs> the goat! Watch this. A lot of them out here, huh, Nelson? Oh yeah. Just keep doing your thing, bro. You're on fire today, man. Oh! Oh! <laughs> one right there. Oh! Oh! She recovered him, y'all. He just dumped him. Oh! See the dried branch that's hanging yeah. right here? Follow it straight up. His head is right there, and his tail's hanging down. Oh! Oh! oh. All right, you guys, so the boys are on another iguana. Holy smokes. Oh, the size of that tail. 
Oh! Oh! Dude, that's a cone! Dude, oh, get him. Right there. Perfect. Go, go, go. Oh! No way, bro. This place is a honey hole for iguanas out here in Puerto Rico. You got it? Mm. Oh! <laughs> That's a beast! Oh my gosh! Huge! Dude, watch out for snakes! I tell you that as you're going down there, right? And count up our numbers. I swear, dude. Look, there's dogs over there by the trolley, dude. Dogs usually have big bites, bro. It's true. Go ahead. Strap up, bro. We're going in. This is not even all of our kill, y'all. We have about, I think, nine or 10 more at the car. All these iguanas. We have this dog that's been following us for the last half a mile. Um, I don't know what he wants, but. Uh... Get out of here! He's growled at us, bro. Dude, there goes the dogs right there. Oh my God, one, two. I think there's like two or three more back there, dude. We gotta hurry up to the train. Dude, the dog keeps following us, bro. He's following our trail. All right, you guys, so we're back at the train. We have the iguanas that we caught earlier. Counting any of these giant monsters that we just caught over there on the other side of this little reservoir, bro. Talking about Nace right here, putting in work with that sniper gun. We got Sam, we got Nelson. Everybody pulling their own weight and getting a share of some of these giant iguanas. So as you guys can see, we caught a lot of iguanas. That means there's gonna be a lot of food on the dinner table tonight. None of these iguanas will be going to waste. Oh, dang. So as you guys know, the green iguana is extremely invasive reptiles that live in South Florida and Puerto Rico. They're extremely dangerous to Puerto Rico because they eat a lot of the native plants that people rely on to eat and feed their families. All right, you guys, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, and six, y'all. Of today's hunt, y'all, is 26 iguanas, all thanks to Nelson Knoxville right here, Big Sam with the amazing shooting eye, and of course, Nelson. Alright you guys, I gotta go. It is the Iguana Man. Right now we're with the big homie Bryce from a Higher View TV. We are on our way to do something amazing when we came across this dead alligator on the side of the road. This alligator and just look at some of the things of him. He is pushing... I'm six foot. Oh my gosh. Check this out right here. Look at the claws. He's missing some of the toes. Probably been. Look, he actually has fluids like oozing out of like the skin. Like it's like he's about to pop or something like that. Yep. It's the organs inside of him. That we've seen is there's actually like a shield of a car right there. Mm. So somebody could have been driving really fast, crushed this alligator. I mean, it's right next to it, bro. What is it? What is it, it from like us? There might be a little blood right there. Oh, yeah. Some dried blood, maybe? Look, apparently, one of these alligators came inside of the spring and is somewhere lurking in the entire park. Uh, we're with Bryce from a higher view TV. I'm a licensed alligator farming trapper. Do not do this unless you guys have proper training. This alligator, as you can see, they've been baiting them up with chicken on a large hook. Hopefully the alligator will swim by, grab the bait, launch on, and then they got dinner. Even goes from this crystal clear water all the way down you guys to pay close attention to how the chicken is just above the surface of the water you do not want it to be inside of the water because when the alligator gets it you kind of want him to be hung up so that hook stays really tight oh 
Dude, what? Those carp or shiners? I don't know. Boys, check this out. Can I pet your iguana? We just caught this iguana. Be careful, dude. He's wild, bro. Hi. What's up, buddy? Right. He's, he's very chill. Does he high How five? How you doing, bro? He does. Give Put it on the grill. Oh, no. That's <laughs> <laughs> good. Dude. Guys, be careful. There's wild alligators and wild iguanas at this park. Okay. We just caught this one right here. So if there's one, there's got to be more. Be really careful. Be really careful. So we're farming a whole bunch of animals. We were in search for the alligator, but we came up with the iguana. They have them growing up, man. They never got that big, though. Please touch them. 